Hey you guys. Um, so nutrition is queen. This is Rachel Daly and I wanted to share with you just some thoughts while I'm sitting in my car really quick and um, some things that we've been going over with a couple of clients and some of my girls. And have you ever like worked out like crazy and you're you're just not on point with your nutrition or you just feel like you're eating clean and you're just not getting the results and you're just freaking frustrated. And honestly, you guys, like you can't outwork a bad diet. And a lot of times a uh, bad diet, which I hate that word diet, but like a lot of people, a lot of women especially, I know that there's men out there too, but we've been so conditioned to eat lower calories and um and so what happens is during the week like they're eating super low they might be eating super clean um but then fall off on the weekends or um maybe you like indulge in some drinks or parties or whatever and it's not always the weekends like i've seen actually recently a lot of my clients um nutrition reports because I have them fill out nutrition reports every single week so I can see what they're eating. Um, they're actually eating really clean but maybe they aren't getting enough protein in or they're um, not quite hitting carbohydrates or getting the right kind of carbohydrates. And so today we were talking about how important, it's not just important to know um, your macronutrient numbers and how much protein, carbs, and fats you're supposed to have it's really important to remember to get your micros in, which is the stuff that um, like cleans your body from the inside out. It gives you the antioxidants. It's your fruits and vegetables and all those things that are actually really good for you, um, where a lot of people are so focused on, okay, I've got to eat this much more food, but they're, they're still putting in a lot of processed food. So really instead of focusing on taking out all of the bad stuff one thing that you can do is add in more good stuff so I like to do that by adding in um, a green smoothie because I'm getting a lot of nutrients in one one shot basically of a meal and it just starts replenishing and giving your body like the actual nutrients that you need instead of so I'm still like a real person I will still have you know a gluten-free cookie or I will still have pizza I will still have those things but <clears throat> I actually have a lot less of those things when I'm adding in more nutrients and so really the the best option always is to go to more whole foods unprocessed foods things that don't come from a box like an apple is an apple a banana is a banana like you don't even have to read the labels or um like worry about all this stuff especially like people will tell me I, well i got to worry about the sugar content and all that well your body uses it differently than than a cookie or than a donut. Even though the macros are still the same macros, you might still have 20 grams of carbs in each one, you're getting different nutrients and different things that your body can actually utilize to keep you healthy. Because it's not just about losing weight, it's actually about like feeling good, being healthy, having your heart work right, being able to run and play with your kids, um, being able to go hiking and and be able to enjoy life and you actually need those things that come from God's earth he provided what we need already in our in our foods like in our foods that our bodies know what to do to process and digest those things and so I'm gonna give you a couple of tips the first one is add in more fruits and vegetables. If you do that, what changes the game is you you might still have um, cake or you might still have cookies or you might still have chips, but the thing is you're gonna feel so full and so abundant and so good that you will actually naturally have less of the bad stuff, 
right? Like you'll have more good things and your skin will thank you. Your energy levels will thank you. Like you will just feel better because you're putting natural good things into your body. The second thing, add more water. Um, dehydration is a huge thing that happens in like pretty much everybody because we're so consumed with coffee and um, energy drinks and diet sodas and all of that. If you honestly shoot for a gallon of water, you will naturally have less of those things. So those are my two tips. If you are somebody that gets confused with, um, with nutrition and you want help just kind of getting, getting, finding out like your personal numbers, what's going to work for you. Um, that's what I do. I tailor your macros to you and then I watch your food reports. I have you turn them in for accountability. I watch your food reports and then little by little we start making, um, changes and I can give you small little things that um, you can easily implement into your life so it's not like a diet and um, it just helps you get little by little you can lose weight by adding in more nutritious things and um, I can help you do that and, and be by your side while you're doing it because the truth is like I'm not gonna lie when you are not eating that way it is it can feel really hard and really confusing with all of the myths out there, all of the diet rules out there. Like you guys know, a lot of times we combine all the rules from all the diets we've ever been on and then we just get so confused um, because we feel like we're eating clean and, and just not seeing the results. So if you are wanting some help with that, um, go to www.girlonfireempire.com. I will put the link in here and you can fill out a questionnaire which gets you on a call with me and um, and then we can see if it's something that it, that you um, that you can benefit from and if not it's no big deal but I am telling you like, it, it makes a difference to have somebody by your side. Um, it fast tracks you, especially on the days that you just feel like, Ugh, I'm not getting anywhere, or I don't understand it. When you have somebody else's eyeballs on your food, it, it just helps you make better decisions when maybe you don't feel like it. So I will put the link below and I hope you guys have a fabulous day.